today on Papa's Project, we're running that three and a half ton upstairs AC heat pump that came with the house. And we're running that with now just 15 used poly panels that we picked up for an average of, oh, it was between 30 and $38 a piece when we bought them. So we just have 15 used poly panels right there. Just that array running that heat pump. Air conditioning house. We have it at uh, set at 70. So that'll run for probably about 20, 30 minutes to get it to that point. And we're just running that. There's a better view of the solar panels. They're just poly panels that we bought used, 250 watts. They put out under ideal conditions, just a little bit under nine amps each. Um, and that's if it's ideal conditions. So that's running off that grow watt, 12 kilowatt, low frequency off grid inverter. And if we can run that with just 15 panels on there, we'll definitely be able to run this four ton up our downstairs unit. There's the three and a half, there's the four ton. And that is a one ton premium. It's a one ton premium, 12,000 BTU, 120 volt. That is a aux, um, 12,000 BTU, 120 volt. Let's use like eight, nine amps. This thing uses like 30 to 40 amps on that inverter. Um, as we're, when this is running, it's like eight or nine amps. And this is like nine or 10 amps on that one. If they're the same thing, but this one is just a little bit bigger. And it's able to do about a hundred square feet more in cooling down or heating. Cause these cool and heat. Um, in the rooms so we're pretty happy with the uh, results we got from this and like I said we bought those used panels we're only using a 48 volt AGM battery bank that is a light catcher solar um, deep cycle batteries specifically for solar and when we bought those, they were like 186. Now I think they're like 230, 240. Um, but we've had no problems with those things. At the end of the day, we like to have those things charged up around 52 to 54 volts when we turn the inverters off. Because so we're pretty much just running this stuff during the day. And then last night, we cooled our house down to 60 degrees upstairs, turned it off around 5, 5.30, and then we never turned our AC, upstairs AC on or the small heat pumps on all night long because the house was cold and it was 98 degrees outside yesterday. So we only used 16 kilowatts and that's basically the hot water heater going in the morning the oven running at night, the TV's on, uh, dishwasher going, um, just pretty much stuff like that. It's, it's basically about three quarters of a kilowatt per hour that we're using. But our main cost is the pool, heating the pool, and running our air conditioner. Because in April, this time of the year, it's 90 to 100 degrees out here and uh it is around eight o'clock in the morning and it is already uh 80 82 degrees so 
<laughs> we like to fire up the air conditioners early to keep that thing cooled down. And it is doing a wonderful job. I really love this 12 kilowatt inverter. The fact that I can run a three and a half ton whole house heat pump off of just 15 solar panels is amazing to me. So I can still hook up another 55 panels and have a 70 panels connected to that thing, which eventually I will do. But right now I'm really enjoying just being able to run that air conditioner upstairs, the whole upstairs air conditioner for free. Please like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that notification bell. And we hope you have a truly wonderful and very blessed day.